Hi, this is my review of the GS8000L portable, advanced portable car camcorder. Uh, it goes into your car and you can put it on the window, either the front window or the back window. It will record either in front of you where you're driving or the passengers or even the driver. If you put it in the back window, you can record where you're coming from or again inside the car. Included with this set is the camcorder um, and the suction cup is really good. Uh, I even put it on my window, my car window that I had not cleaned yet um, and it stuck. It was it was well on there so that I have to give kudos to. The camera is right here that would be facing whichever direction you want to record has a very nice screen. Also included is the SD card, an 8 gig SD card. And that inserts into the side slot here. So you just put that in. Whoops. Have it upside down. So you just push that in. There is so it would hang like this. So it has the power button right on this side. There we go. So you can see it's recording behind me. At least it's showing it um, and you can see the flashing red light to show that it is recording. You can shut that off using this button here and that would stop it. Um, that would also start the recording. There is a menu button on this side with a lot of different options. So what you would do is push the menu and it shows the different options. There are the video options. Sorry, this isn't showing you very well because of the glare. Um, there's a video options and then there's the general settings. And on the video options, you can choose your resolution. So we would just use the down button to get to that and then push the record button to select it. So in this, for example, it, we have the choices of 1080 HD, 1080, or I'm sorry, it's 1080 FHD, 1080p, 720p, WVGA, or if you scroll down even farther, you have the option of VGA also. Get out of there we're going to we can either select or we can use the mode button I'm sorry we'll go into the menu again and I won't go through each of these but there are the choices on the video menu um, for the settings of the resolution the loop recording exposure motion detection whether you want to record the audio um, you can set that on or off um, you can set whether you want your video to be date stamped, um, so it can either be set on or off. And there's also the G sensor, so you can choose between using 2, 4, or 8 gig or have that off. The general settings, you would push the menu button one more time. That would move it over to the general settings. And on this menu, you can choose park mode, for example. If we go down to park mode and select that by pushing the record button, we can choose between 2 gig, 4 gig, 8 gig, or off. It has a lot. We have park mode, um, setting the time and the date. We have um, whether you want a screensaver, whether you want it to our auto power off after a certain amount of time, um, whether you want a beep sound what language, the TV mode, frequency, 
whether you're going to have the flash on or off and then for formatting and default setting you can put it back to the default setting and it will also tell you your um, version also included in the set is a car charger that plugs into the um, cigarette lighter the cord is enormous it must be 10 feet um, as a matter of fact I do believe I measured it and it was 10 feet so it would fit into your back window um, easily and there is also a USB cable for charging that's included so you can either charge it from your um, computer or a USB charger um, one of the the things that it is missing it's missing I mean it has everything that you could immediately as soon as you unpackage it you could put it into your car um, but what I have found that it's missing is the let me see um, is the little card reader that goes into your computer so that it can get so that you're able to get the videos off of here I did have to buy that separately um, I did try to plug in the cable and just connect that into my computer because sometimes it will um, find itself to be another drive. This one did not. So you do need that card. Uh, you are able to change as far as from the mode. You can change right now. It's on taking photos. If you click again, you're now on being able to take the videos. I'm sorry, no, that's showing us what we already have. If we click again, now we have the video icon. It's very nice. Uh, let me show it to you without the glare. So you can see the video icon up here. Um, it's very nice. I really like it. The resolution is excellent. I will try to attach an example of that. Um, I highly recommend it. Thanks for watching.